commit a crime, huh? What kind of crime? Well, I have discovered this wonderful little jewelry store downtown called Hanson's. If you were to go in before me and pick out something delicious, slip it away while the clerk was looking somewhere else? You mean steal it? Well, after all, you were the one who said you had aspirations towards this sort of thing. How'd it go? Well, I did it. I took that ring and I passed it to Jenna practically underneath that guard's nose. Really? Yeah. I bet you didn't think I could do it, did you? Well, I did it. You know, I think I've missed my calling here. A jewel thief makes a heck of a lot more money than a cop does. And obviously, I have this natural talent for it. You should have seen this rock mallet. It was like 10 carats. It was uh, huge. 8.2, to be exact. 8.2, 10. What's the difference? It was what? How did you know that? The jeweler called after you left, gave us all the details. What? What does that mean? Am I going to get arrested? Uh, I told Ross what was going down. If he hadn't called, you'd be the prettiest little jewel thief in jail. Uh, yeah. Not to mention, there goes my cover. Well, I guess I'm not the thief that I thought I was. Hey. You stole my heart, didn't you? You're so sweet. <laughs> if you knew, why did you let me go on like that? Because you look cute with your foot in your mouth. <laughs> No, seriously, I'm very proud of you, Coop. This could be the breakthrough we needed. Yeah, I know. What's our next move? Well, we uh, wait for the wedding day and keep our eyes open. Yeah. Jenna could have a few more tricks up her sleeve. Yeah. Well, at least I passed her test, right? I mean, I'm definitely in on the wedding heist. Yeah. Now we find out her plans and we set our trap. Yeah. Okay, well, I guess I better get out of here and get back to my place. I gotta find Jenna. What are you gonna do? I'm gonna go home and try to talk some sense into Julie. Seems my little sister decided that the big one ate means she's old enough to have sex. Oh. oh. Uh, do you want me to talk to her? No, thanks. This is between me and her. I just hope she waited for me and didn't take off with him. Well, you know, big brother, you should try to remember something. She's not a little girl anymore. I know. I'm trying. I just don't like people I love getting hurt. And that includes you. I know. But, I mean, at this point, she has to believe that I'm as big a crook as she is, right? <laughs>